Okay, so I ended up losing the lashes that were in the corner. And I actually really like that. I need to board. They took it from both sides. Yeah, baby! <laughs> okay, made it to Puerto Rico to the first spot. Wow, yeah. Where are we? La Teresa. La Teresa. I'm gonna speak very bad Spanish. Oh, look at the whites. lovelies so just opening up the vlog today is technically day one of my puerto rico trip i'm staying here for a week so there will be a nice puerto rico vlog week vlog coming up and i am going to get ready to go to the beach but first i'm gonna film my amazon haul for the trip since it's beautiful, it's sunny, so I'm gonna get that done. And I don't think I'm gonna do my makeup. I'm just gonna do it all on my Sony. I'm watching Lala's New York vlog. I freaking love it. I had such a good time at New York for New York Fashion Week last weekend. The fact that I'm on a trip following weekend, this is not a norm, but it's definitely exciting. I love it, I love the change of pace. So, yeah, let me jump into doing the Amazon haul video. Done filming. I forgot. That's what I forgot to bring. I knew I forgot something. Please, Lord, let it be in here. I forgot to bring the thing to export the videos. I'm going to have to buy a new one here. I'm going to have to film with my phone. That's, like, the easiest way for me to get the footage from... Darn it, I forgot that. Right now we're parking and we're at 
to tell. But it's okay. This is our norm. It is a norm. I get out of Surani. So awkward taking photos of myself. I know that. Oh my god, I have this camera on a tree. You can't even see the wood. Okay, I'll do it again. Yeah, look at you can go to the bar so that So stoked, it's not even funny. I love the beach, guys. I love the beach. We are beaching so hard. It's the, best. the tan that I am getting, everyone's gonna know I've been here. Well, they're gonna be like, dang, you left with no tan, I need to come back with a full tan. <laughs> Like one of my favorite swimsuits. I got this one in Aria, and I think we're about to head out. It's pretty late, but it's so pretty. I really like this beach. So if you are ever traveling to Puerto Rico, Montones is such a nice beach, especially if you have like little kids, just cause the current's not strong. But yeah, it's definitely a family-friendly beach. Hobos is more for like surfing. The currents are pretty strong, but it's really good for people that want to learn the sport. And yeah, tomorrow they're going to another beach. I'll take y'all with me. I'm starving. All I had was a piece of bread, eggs, and like three beers. That is a cat. That's a cat. Everyone's looking at the cat. I am so excited for this biscuit. Yeah, but they brought it back. And more ketchup. Finally using my thrifted dress. And this is the look for the night. We're gonna go out, see what we find, because it's President's Day and apparently everything's closed for today. And I'm wearing my Amazon heels. And we shall see where the night takes us. Okay, we stopped on one place called Pizza Something. There's the ambulance. But we shall continue the road trip. The vibes were not 
what we wanted it to be. We go. Okay, so we made it to the Capitol. Did I think we were gonna be here? No. We made it. There are a few spots open. Thankfully, there's at least there's something. You know, we will take what we can get on President's Day. linen shirt that my mom washed with bleach <laughs> i gave her a hard time about it but it is softening up thank god she's like whatever she says is law because she's like it's gonna get soft and i'm getting anxious about my favorite linen shirt get some pinchos because Crashbow has the best pinchos I've had in a while. Hopefully they taste just as good as the last time. I got pupu salad. It cost me ten dollars and we shall see if it's worth. right now we had shark pork chicken shrimp mahi mahi and what's left is shrimp and pollo uh, what happened you can talk to me no no i'm good you can talk to me while i broke <laughs> but we ended up getting chicken and shrimp <laughs> Oh, I ate the pinchos. They were definitely worth the wait. We waited in line for like quite some time. But let me show y'all how beautiful, breathtaking this sunset looks at Crash Boat. He looks, it looks like a postcard. It looks so pretty to take photos. There is the sunset, guys. It's coming. It's like in, in that corner between the clouds right here. We're about to pack up to leave. We have to get up early. 
to hit up more beaches in Culebra, so that's tomorrow. I'm trying shark now. I don't know how I feel about that. It just tastes salt. Because it's too sweet. The it tastes like fish. It tastes like fish. It's scary. Shark is a fish. I know that shark is a fish, but that would not be my preference. I would not eat a shark. Do you like shark? It's okay. Okay. You know what? It would have been slamming if it had been fried. Okay. <laughs> it's scary. I feel bad for the shark. Today we are headed to Culebra, it's like a three hour drive. So, just bringing a tote with me. Yeah, I'm like debating if I wanna drink coffee or not right now. Probably not. As y'all can tell, a girl is tired. Noah, this way. So we're gonna go pick up everybody. And Yamalet and I are the drivers of said go karts. Yes, let's go. Look at the tan. Look at that tan. We went to three beaches today, which is Flamingo, where we are at now, Sunny Beach, and Tamarindo Beach. I didn't film the other two beaches, but I got to see a sea turtle. I wish I could have vlogged that, but I was far. It was my first time snorkeling. A girl was nervous and I had a blast. I learned. It's like a learn as you go experience. We didn't have anyone teach us. We just winged it and it was very fun. I got to see silver fishes in this beach, in Flamingo Beach. I got to see turtles, more fishes. And now to get dried up, change and See what we do next. I look insane right now, but I made me some breakfast, so I'm gonna eat this up. Today's supposed to be a chill day. Bethany was so sweet, she did my eyebrows. I'm excited because she's gonna study beauty, so. Once all her info is out, I'm gonna be sure to share it on the channel for the lovelies. And if you're a New York girlie, you might be graced your brows done by her, but she did such an amazing job. It's been a while since I've done my eyebrows. Okay, right now I'm gonna do my hair real quick with all the products that I did on my reel. I wish I could just share it on here too. I might do a short and share it on here. So be sure to check out the YouTube short on 
the hair products that I use for Puerto Rico, they're all made from, I think most of the products are made in Santo Domingo and they're known for their hair products, skin products, like chef's kiss. Whenever you're visiting, I highly, highly, highly recommend to look into getting their products. What is going on now? Today we're gonna go and see Madame Web at the movie theaters. We came late. Well, technically not late because we could have watched the one I wanted to watch, but it was in Spanish. And I don't feel like trying to understand what these people are saying and whatever it's type of- It's not you don't understand, it just makes more sense. No, okay, this is what I mean. I don't wanna try to understand whatever Spanish they use, cause you know it's not the Spanish we talk. It could be España, it could be Mexico. And the way they say certain things, it's different from Puerto Rico Spanish. And I'm not trying to break my head when I barely understand what the plot of the movie is. And the jokes, if there are jokes, because now everything got to have a joke to it. They're just not going to hit. So I'm starving. I refuse to eat the food at home. Did you eat? Yes, you did. You didn't eat? I ate earlier, yeah. I didn't eat the pastel. So we're gonna eat Pan Express because <laughs> American. <laughs> what happened, mom? If I were to look into headphones. Ah. I cannot eat here because apparently it's more comfortable in the car. But they just clean, that's why. I'm breaking up. I gotta eat on the car because these people did not want to let us eat in there because they just finished freaking cleaning. I cannot. And it's eight something. They close at nine. Like we could have eaten. So annoying. But I'm gonna eat here. I don't care. I'm not moving. Ooh, it looks so good. We go to the theater to ourselves. Call us VIP. Hey. You want some chocolate? No, I'm okay. Why, you want chocolate? I feel like I need some sweet. Okay, we did eat food. Let's go check it out. This, we're still giving the, like previews and we have a private screening. to get some frituras this is the pastelillo de camarón and i'm gonna try the hot sauce of guayaba so we shall see it i don't know i'm gonna try it let me try this pastelillo first okay the pastelillo something real gringo okay everyone's trying to make me try everything by everyone i mean my mom there's my mom i'm waiting for it to cool down because it's really hot but look at this look at this view stunning view Oh my god, that's why my children, whenever they born, if they born, they're gonna be British or English. I don't know yet, I haven't decided. Oh my god, this is the hot sauce in my bag swag, and this one is really good. I like it, it's not that spicy. The sauce of the guayaba, yeah, it's a tad sweet. You can definitely taste the guayaba. I really like it, and this is really good. Oh my god. Mm. I'm gonna throw some more salsa de guayaba. this no because I have it what is that mama crop top I like that 
I like the brown one. The brown one's, the, the brown one's really cute. This is really cute. So then I would honestly be more comfortable with an extra large. This is cute. Okay, let's try this on. Okay, so for this portion of the vlog is a Walmart try on one in Puerto Rico. Did you go if you did not go to Walmart? No. <laughs> so I have three pieces to try on and I'm gonna show it to y'all. Y'all let me know in the comments what you like. Okay, so this is the first top. Crazy enough, this is an extra large. It feels really nice. It feels really soft. It feels like a bodysuit. And it's not. It's a shirt. I think there's a lot to do with this. It's very stretchy. But I tucked it in because I didn't really like how it looked tucked out. And this is the first piece. Okay, so they put like the sensor thing here so i couldn't unbutton it completely but it's okay because i actually really like how this looks like this i like the sleeves i kind of wish it was a bit more puffy but since we're on the island it does get hot it does get cool and i kind of feel like that's why the holes are so big but this is look well piece number two so this one is obviously a dress but i've been liking the jean on dress style lately this has to be my favorite look it looks way cuter buttoned up here this i have to, i wish this was just like a string if not this would have been perfect number one i probably would have gotten it but i actually really like it i like that i like this whole long short situation going on okay so in aria I'm trying on swimsuits. I really like this one. It's really nice. I like this buckle here. I want to get one pair, but I do have another two piece that I'm gonna try on. This looks really nice. I like how it feels. And they're 50 bucks each piece. This one, like, you don't even have to tie it or anything. I have my panty on because I don't like trying on swimsuits without, like, production. I think I might take this one. Okay, so I really like the first one. I thought I was gonna like this one. But no, I think I'm gonna go with the first one. But let me show y'all the pants. They're so comfy. Oh my god, they feel so freaking soft. I see myself leaning a lot towards taking the pants as a cover-up because I think I, I lean a lot towards my long pants and that's not really a practical cover-up so. glasses I really like which are the peach ones I like the white ones I like the round ones I don't hate these either a girl did some damage I'm gonna go to Old Navy I am really happy with what I got the thing is I trust like my bathing suits from area have been so good quality and it's pretty affordable and Old Navy Old Navy. Okay. And I'm really happy with what I got. Did an outfit change. This got a truck. This is my mom's shirt. That looks good. Mmm. That's good, mom. Mmm. Okay, mom. Okay, mommy. I got sushi. There's so much food. So, this. so this is sushi a la boricua. Sushi a la boricua. My mom gave to me cream brulee. Look at that. They even gave they gave her the little container too. Okay, we're gonna critique it. So how I critique my creme brulee is based off of three things. When you crack, if it if it cracks right, how the texture is. 
and the sweetness of said creme brulee. So let's crack it. What? What happened to your bud? Where's your underwear? It didn't crack, how it. It's yeah, hard. so it it has a very thin layer of burnt sugar. Okay. The consistency. My God. Moral of the story, guys. It tastes like blood. <laughs> it's very pudding like. But the sweetness of it is actually pretty good. Whoa! Out of the three categories, it passes in flavor. Do you want to taste it? So it got one out of three. Oh my God. So full. I'm waiting for Yamale to try it so that she can. <laughs> I just, I've eaten a lot of creme brulee in my life. I thought it was a flan. I thought it was a flan. Because that is the creme brulee of Puerto Rico. A lot is happening right now. But, you know, it is what it is. <laughs> I know you can. They don't know where they're going. I have so much anxiety driving this car that I made it and my mom is driving. are huge but then again everyone has like yards here look at that look at the eggs i know look at this yeah i see that <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh this is cute again bunny stop mom that is ugly <laughs> that looks terrifying <laughs> Too late for that. 